Today we're gonna do a compression test on the 7.3 IDI. Um, we picked up this kit, this uh, diesel engine compression tester from Harbor Freight Tools. I watched the video last night on it, and they say this is the one for the Ford. It doesn't want to go in all the way for the glow plug. Well, I'll check it out, and we'll let you guys know personally, so you guys can get some information on that. Uh, so since we already have the injectors out, we're gonna go this route using this uh, dummy dummy plug to test it and uh, stay tuned Okay, so 7.3 IDI That plug or that block fits perfect you got the, the Fitting for the gauge Here's the gauge I'm gonna check Fuel. We're gonna see fuel coming out the fuel lines. Yes, yeah, the glow plugs. There we go. Nothing on number one. Told you. Alright, so we're moving on to the next cylinder on this side. Number one was dead. Let's see what we got in this cylinder. See, we got a difference. So, definitely number one's dead. Alright. Yeah, 340. Okay, YouTube, here's an update on the compression tester. Uh, we have the old style IDI 7.3 international engine. Um, we did a compression test on it. Uh, what I've heard was with these glow plug uh, adapters, they're too long. And yes, I did confirm that. It is too long. It bottoms out before it reaches the threads. So what I'm going to do, I'm just going to shear it off a little bit. Other than that. It should work fine, but I went with the injector plug and did the test that way. It worked fine. Everything else works perfect to me. The gauge, release valve, all that. So, here's your update. All right, guys. Excuse my camera. I might have a little bit of a little bit of oil. Kind of still a little glare to it. All right, inform the customer about the valve, number one cylinder up front. Um, so he doesn't want to mess with the driver's side. So we're gonna pull the head. Gonna get this little intake out the way and go from there. Yep. Stay tuned. Well guys, we got the head off and number one cylinder. That's what it is.